let's get started. So let's just uh, settle into a nice, uh, comfortable, seated posture. And I will, there we go, make it so you can hear me. So it's been very hot here again today, but the wind is blowing, so there's a nice, there's some nice air flowing around. So I just settle. I don't know what the temperature is like wherever you are. I know that there's at least one of you in Arizona, which part just might, sounds like really hot there. So just settle into a nice, comfortable seated posture. And it's good when you, unless you have, I guess you, everyone has air conditioning in some of the hotter parts of the, of the US or anywhere. Um, it's really good to stay still unless you have a pool. So have your feet flat on the floor. And if you're not wearing shoes, maybe take this opportunity to get, you know, familiar with your feet the weight of the soles of the heels, the side of the foot, the big toe mound, the little toe mound, and all your toe pads. Just feel the weight of your legs in your feet. Uh, your hips are about a, sorry, your knees are about a hips width apart, shoulders are over the hips, and the ears are aligned with the shoulders. And imagine your spine is a string of pearls of light stretching from the base all the way up through the crown of the head and beyond. Just bring your attention to the crown of the head and notice if you can feel anything there, any sensation. And just relax the scalp, top of the head, relax the forehead, the eyes, the nose, the cheeks, and the area around the mouth. Relax the back of the head, the back of the neck. Allow your shoulders and shoulder blades to drop down. Relax your throat chest and belly and all of your limbs. So just relax here, but you know, the idea is to be alert. And notice the sensation of the air as you inhaling and exhaling. And be aware of the sounds in your environment. Um, is the sound, are the sounds different to this time last night? It's also getting a, a tiny bit darker in the evenings. The sun is shifting. So we, here we have... Uh, Impermanence in action as we move through the summer, coming up for our last our last month of summer officially. And then just notice uh, the thoughts that are arising in the mind. So if somehow you were caught up in this um, little technical glitch that happened uh, with Microsoft today that seemed to have affected many, many people, many businesses all over the world, including airlines, somehow that was affecting you as well. 
you might have had a bit of a stressful day. Or not, <laughs> if you couldn't work. Maybe you just had a holiday. I don't know. But just try and, you know, if whatever thoughts are arising, just try and put some space in between those thoughts. And then just notice what's arising in the mind. Just allow it. And then as you allow it, notice it's there, develop some awareness around your thoughts and then try to take a step back from them. To go in the opposite direction to what we normally want to do, which was to follow the story and engage in the story. Just put it, just go backwards. It is completely exactly opposite to what you probably want to do or what you are habitually do. So imagine you're rewinding, you know, in the old those old fashioned days where they just with the movies. And just be aware of what's going on in your mind as if you're in a I don't know, like you you're a scientist, you're objectively observing what's going on. And then bring to mind all the people of our life and we start with our loved ones. You know, these people are so precious to us. Just even if you have one friend in the world. I I saw just a very quick thing of Michelle Obama talking about the value of friendship and never to take your best friends for granted, your best buddy. It's one who's always going to be there for you. And then there's uh, people that we aren't so familiar with, but, you know, we need to be grateful to these people. Oh, sorry, not that, sorry, not that we don't like so much, but we need to be grateful for those people because if they irritate you in any way or annoy you or you seem to notice all the bad things about them, this this person is very valuable to you because they show you your mind. That is such a gift. It might not be comfortable. It's a gift. And then there's our strangers. And these people are all equal in their wish to be happy, their wish to be free from suffering, and in having this extraordinary capacity for Buddhahood. So we we start by thinking, you know, first of all, we motivate, we motivate and you know, for doing this practice for the benefit of all these people of our life and by extension, all sentient beings. So we start by thinking that there is no negativity that can't be purified. And this purification process is basically a psychological one. So we create negativity with our mind. So equally, we can change it by creating positivity instead. And we start with the power of regret. So sincerely regret from the depths of your heart anything you have done to harm any living being on this day, in this life, and in all of our past lives, and think of specific actions of both your body and your speech, and then in general, regret all. And the reason to regret is based on this logic of karma, and we experience everything due to our past karma, our past actions, and having harmed others, we ourselves will necessarily experience suffering in the future, and we cannot bear the thought of any future suffering that we might experience. And we know from our present suffering, we don't want any more. So logically, it just makes sense to remove the karmic seeds before they ripen as future suffering for us. So think like this. I regret from the depths of my heart, having harmed others with my body and my speech, having broken my vows because I do not want the future suffering. I'm sick of suffering. And also regret any anger, attachment and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others, and then think again, I'm sick of this suffering, and then think, what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So here we come to this power of reliance has two little sections. And so the first one is about refuge. So here we're relying upon the Buddha Vajrasattva to give us these methods that we can use to purify ourselves. So it's not like a higher power. 
you know, a god, a, a deity that we're kind of bowing bowing down to in that way. No, no, no. We we are fully engaged here, taking responsibility, having regret, knowing that we can do something about, you know, the things that we've done that we're not so happy about. There's no guilt here. It's just taking responsibility. And then we have this beautiful way of dealing with it, this beautiful way of working with our minds. It's actually, you know, quite easy. But takes a little bit of effort. That's all. So imagine Vajrasattva above the crown of your head. You can also imagine this is the mind of your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit. And he has this, uh, you know, he's sitting there, this radiant, blissful white light. His legs are crossed, you know, in the meditation posture. He has a beautiful, peaceful face, and he's looking at you and all the people of your life equally. No one gets left behind. Everyone's taken care of. Everyone's picked up. No one's pushed away. It's just something a little hard because we want to kind of get rid of the ones we don't like. And then, you know, his arms are crossed at his heart, the left underneath the right. And this represents uh, enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. This is the, this is, uh, the bell represents wisdom and the vajra represents indestructibility of compassion. And the two together represent this enlightened mind. To the Buddha, the Dharma, and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened by this practice of meditating on Guru Vajrasattva. May I reach Buddhahood so as to benefit all sentient beings. So then we have this other little section uh, on compassion. In order, in order to develop compassion, we need to rely upon other beings, the very beings we have harmed, and those who have harmed us by developing compassion for them. So I think particularly of someone you may have harmed recently and in the past, and then in general, all beings we have ever harmed since beginningless time. And then remember those who have harmed you and just have compassion for them because the harm they've caused you is going to result as suffering for them sometime in the future. So make a strong aspiration to do this practice of purification for the sake of all these beings and think I must purify for their sake. So now we come to the power of the remedy and this is the medicine doing the practice of purification, and we start with the body. And Bhadrasattva very compassionately sends powerful white nectar, like coming out of a hose, quite forcefully from his heart, and it arcs around and enters your crown and pours into your entire body, filling you completely. And it keeps pouring into you until it forces out all of your, of all of your lower orifices, all the harm you've ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid. And this pours out of you and it disappears into space, not one atom left, as we recite the mantra. Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dina Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Supokaya Mebawa Anuracta Mebawa Sava Siddhi Mempi Yatsa Sava Kama Sitta Me Sittam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tatagata Vajra Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hompe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Supokaya Mebawa Anuracta Mebawa Sava Siddhi Mempi Yatsa Sava Kama Sitta Me Sittam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hompe Vajra Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dida Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anuracta Mebawa Sava Siddhi Mempi Yatsa Sava Kama Sitta Me Sittam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hompe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anuracta Mebawa Sava Siddhi Mempi Yatsa Sava Kama Sitta Me Sittam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hompe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Mebawa Sutokaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa 
Anu recta me boa sava sidi mimpi yata sava kama sita me sitam shriam kuru hum ha 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 ho bagu and sava tata gata vajra mutta vajra bawa maha samaya satra a hum pe and vajra sapha samaya manupalaya vajra sapha dina patita dida me boa sito kaya me boa sipo kaya me boa Anu recta me boa sava sidi mimpi yata sava kama sita me Sitam Shriyam Guru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Dida Me Bawa Situ Kaya Me Bawa Sipo Kaya Me Bawa Anurakta Me Bawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Guru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum so be delighted that all the harm you've ever done to any sentient being with your body is now completely purified and think that there's no way you could do anything but benefit others now with your body. And next is the purification of our speech and Vajrasattva very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra and this arcs around and quite forcefully enters your crown and fills your entire body except this time forcing up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech and this overflows and disappears into space, not one atom left. So imagine all the harsh speech and the gossip, the useless speech, lying and talking badly about others behind their backs, getting other people to agree with you. All of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you as we recite the mantra again. Vajra Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dida Me Boa Situ Kaya Me Boa Sipo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajra Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dida Me Boa Situ Kaya Me Boa Sipo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta me boa sava sidi mimpi yata sava kama sita me sitam shriyam karu hum ha ha ho bhagavan sava tata gata vajra mami mutta vajra bawa maha samaya satra a hum pe vajra sapha samaya manupalaya vajra sapha dina patita dida me boa situ kaya me boa sipo kaya me boa Anurakta me boa sava sidi mimpi yata sava kama sita me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagavan sava tata gata vajra mami mutta vajra bawa maha samaya satra a hum pe vajra sapha samaya manupalaya vajra sapha dina patita dida me boa situ kaya me boa sipo kaya me boa Anurakta me boa sava sidi mimpi yata sava kama sita me Sitam Shriyam Guru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajra Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dida Me Bawa Situ Kaya Me Bawa Sipo Kaya Me Bawa Anurakta Me Bawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Guru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajra Sapha Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dida Me Bawa Situ Kaya Me Bawa Sipo Kaya Me Bawa Anurakta Me Bawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Guru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutta Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajra Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dida Me Bawa Situ Kaya Me Bawa Sipo Kaya Me Bawa Anurakta me boa sava sidi mimpi yata sava kama sita me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagavan sava tata gata vajra mami mutta vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. So be, feel so happy that your speech is now completely purified and imagine it's not possible to do anything but benefit others now with your speech. And next is the purification of our mind and Vajrasattva very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra and this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So just imagine you've walked into a, a room, it's pitch black, you reach for the switch and you flick on the you flick it on and the light instantly comes, of course, as we expect. Dispels the darkness. So this the same happens here that imagine 
the moment the light from Vajrasattva's heart hits your heart chakra, all the darkness of the negativity of your mind, so all your attachment and neediness, bitterness, anger, depression, grudges, jealousy, anxiety, all of this instantly dispelled as we recite the mantra again. Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anaracta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sitta Me Sittam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hompe Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta me boa, sabosidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita, dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, sabosidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita, dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, sabosidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita. Dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa. Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita. Dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa. Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita. Dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa. Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum. Again, be so delighted that all your delusions, which are the source of all of our own suffering and the cause of why we harm others with our body and our speech, are completely purified and think that there's no space in your heart now for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. And next is the purification of even the imprints of negativity of the body, speech and mind. And this time, imagine Vajrasattva very happily, very compassionately, sends light and nectar, and it fills you completely and eradicates even the subtlest imprints of negative energy as we recite the mantra again. Vajrasattva Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasattva Dina Patita Dira Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita, dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita, dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, Anarakta me boa, sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sita me, Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hompe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita. 
Dita me boa, sitokaya me boa, sepokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sabo sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam karuhum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajra mami mutsa vajra bawa maha samaya sattva a humpe, and bhajra sattva samaya manupalaya bhajra sattva dina patita, Dita me boa, sitokaya me boa, sepokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sabo sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambhadra Sapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dita Mebawa Sitokaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anorecta Mebawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambhadra Sapha Samaya Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapha Dina Patita Dita Mebawa Sitokaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anorecta Mebawa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe so now, Phil, you are completely purified. There's not one atom of negativity left in your mind stream. Even the subtlest obscurations uh, to your enlightenment have been removed. And now we come to the power of resolve, which is the final step in the purification process, where we just make a decision, a resolve, a resolution that we're not going to harm, that we want to refrain from harming. Before you do that, just rejoice in your efforts coming here, and particularly for people on the East Coast this time of day, it's quite late, actually even for everybody on the, in Central Time as well, Mountain Time as well. And then think of something that you'd like to work on. It could be ruminating about something or someone. If you are ruminating about someone, if there's something going on in your life that's difficult, and you think it's somebody else's fault, then, um, you know, also don't forget to see that person as your teacher because they're showing you your mind. It's very precious. So think like that. And then let's just conclude. Vajrasat was delighted with us, wants to merge with your mind, and melts into white light and absorbs into you through your crown. And you think, <clears throat> my body, speech, and mind, Vajrasat body, speech, and mind, and my own body, speech, and mind are the same. And then, you know, here is a little section on emptiness. In emptiness, there is no I, the creative of negative karma. There is no action of creating negative karma. And there is no negative karma created. So at whatever level you understand emptiness, place your mind there for a little while. We can think of all phenomena as being empty. They do not exist from their own side. We can also think that the way things appear to me may not necessarily be the way they actually exist. <clears throat> Let's just dedicate all the merit, all the positive energy we've created by doing this practice to all living beings and think, may all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. Look, we're almost at the end of the first recitation of the um, chanting the names of Manjushri. They were there a minute ago. What happened? Should we blame Microsoft? Let's just blame Microsoft. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I'm wavering, completely pure in nature, grasping the wakefulness of perfect, Bud perfect Buddhas, the direct realization of all Buddhas. Here's the flame of wisdom, luminous. Nine, the wisdom of equality, the great fulfiller of desired aims, the purifier of all evil states, the greatest of all living beings, protector, the earnest liberator of all creatures, unrivaled knight in battle with afflictions, humiliating ignorance, his foe, the celebrated mind of amorousness, endowed with forms heroic and repulsive. Okay, and let's just dedicate for the long life of His Holiness the Dalai Lama, for the swift return of Lamsa Prabhupada's unmistaken reincarnation, and then, of course, for your own precious teachers. You know, it doesn't even have to be in this tradition. Excuse me. All right. All right. Lots of love, everybody. Good night. Have a nice weekend. Have a good weekend. 
and stay safe. And Monday, you know, I do this, I'm doing this little uh, 35 Buddha practice through the Shanti Davis Center. So I guess you're all very welcome to sign up and come along. You know, and everybody just does the prostrations according to what their body is allowing. You know, I have modifications for people. So if you want to learn any more about them, uh, we're all doing that together on uh, Monday. I think it's 4.30 or something, our time. Your time. My time. 5.30 your time. Okay, everybody. Lots of love. Good night.